This is the finished picture. The watercolor painting is complete. The next phase is to put it into the oven at 170 degrees Fahrenheit. It's important that uh, the temperature not be above 200 degrees Fahrenheit because after that point the wax will begin to discolor and yellow. So to keep it clear, the temperature must be below 200 degrees Fahrenheit and the melting point of wax is 140 degrees Fahrenheit, so I've chosen 170, which is right in between. I'll leave it in the oven for a half an hour to be sure that the wood is heated through and that the paint is completely dried out. While the painting is heating, I'm going to clean the fry pan because there's little specks of color in it left over from other projects. I want to be sure that this is a completely pristine, clean pan and then I'll melt the wax for the encaustic overlay on the painting. The pan cleans up quite easily just with a paper towel and rubbing the wax out. Once it's warm you can see it's kind of dirty. I put more wax into the pan than I will be using just to be sure that I have enough to cover the picture and won't have to uh, fuss with adding more wax and having the picture cool down and any kinds of problems like that. The wax won't go bad, just reheat it and it can be used. And now it's... The painting is hot and the wax is melted. Now it's time to paint. And that's enough. I want to be sure that the uh, surface is covered completely with wax. And so I've put it back into the oven and I'm running over it one last time with the uh, brush. The uh, board had started to cool off and the wax was hardening on these edges here. A little bit too much wax pooled on the edges. So I'll close the door and let it heat up. It's been reheated. There are areas that the wax doesn't seem to be taking. I noticed this the last time I did this on the wood. I don't know if it's not waxed or if it's just the way it's looking. So I'm putting a second layer of wax onto the painting. The wood has cooled and the last step is to buff it to a high sheen, just like you would uh, with varnish.
and there she is, finished.